What is up guys? Welcome back to the channel. You're on S Motorsports. Today, if you saw the last video, I put in the uh, 1LE, uh, ZL1 1LE tail lights, and today we're gonna be finishing it up with the 1LE, ZL1 1LE brake light. So as you guys can see, we got the tail lights if you didn't catch the last episode. But now the only thing that we haven't blacked out basically in the back here is the third brake light, which this should finish up the look. We got um, you know the badges blacked out. We got the um, bottom reflectors blacked out, and obviously the uh, blackout tail lights or the smoke tail lights. So hopefully this should be pretty easy. The hardest part um, is probably going to be scraping all the glue off. So I'll show you guys what we're going to need. All right. So hopefully we're not going to, you know, need too much uh, hair dryer to warm things up. I don't have a heat gun. That's one of the things I need to get. <laughs> Obviously the third brake light. Um, can't remember where I got mine from. I'll look and put the link in the description. But um, a, a little pry tool probably would come in handy. And then uh, I'm gonna use some playing cards. Um, I'm gonna cut a point on one and hopefully just kind of slice it around um, to remove the adhesive so I can just pull the light out so I don't have to remove all the uh, covers uh, underneath the trunk. So I'm doing it the hopefully quicker way. All right, let's get set up and see how it goes. All right, I warmed it up um, with the hair dryer. I don't have a heat gun, that would have been probably better, but we're gonna see how this goes. Okay, I'm gonna take a rag and I put a little pry tool in there um, so we don't scratch the paint. Just gently pry up and see what that does. The playing card I'm finding a little flimsy, so I'm trying a Bondo um, guy to see if that that might work better. It's a little stiffer. I think this definitely worked better. It probably would even work better if you cut it into a tip, which I did not. All right, now I'm gonna scrape all this stuff off, clean it up, and we'll put the new light in then. All right guys, so I got everything cleaned up. I'll show you what I used, but it was a Goo Gone wipe. It worked pretty good. And then that with uh, my fingernail, uh, that got it off pretty quick. So I clean up the area then with, uh, some of my waterless wash just to make sure there's no goo gone left but i use these guys um they they're like a little uh towel you know like a armor all wipe would be that worked pretty good uh, and then cleaned it with that so as you can see we got the clear and black versus the red this is gonna complete the look um and i really make the back end look look mean all right, not much to it now. We're gonna peel this uh, sticker off first and plug it in and push it and stick it in. Obviously, it's got a little up arrow to make sure you got it in the right direction. So, pretty easy. All right, let's get this plugged in. Really can't screw that up. Up, okay. We are good to go. And now we just 
put it in. I'm just gonna hold some pressure on it to make sure we get it seated all the way around. Well guys, that's it for today. Thanks for joining in. Make sure to hit that subscribe button um, as I'm gonna be working on tuning the Camaro some more. Um, and obviously as it gets nicer out, we'll be able to drive it more, do some more driving videos. So stay tuned, make sure to hit that subscribe button. Thanks.